Good morning to all our fellow anglers and South Africa as a whole. It's been seven weeks and uh, so I hope you guys are, are being safe. And you've got your climate sports scarves, very versatile piece of equipment. Yes guys, um, from a logic point of view, you guys saw all our polls, the polls we're running, you saw uh, the interview we had with, with uh, ETV. And for those of you who don't know, the, the total economical impact of 30, 36 billion per annum, the angling industry does. And that's retailers, wholesalers, the tourism part, everything, the subsistence anglers, all of that contribute and over 94,000 jobs in that. It's a massive impact and with angling really aligning itself to be a sport of isolation and um, aligning to the social distancing regulations of South Africa, it doesn't make sense that we're not allowed to fish. So we're keeping on with that, uh, that poll guys, if you haven't voted yet, um, it's a dynamic poll, we keep on sending in the votes we got, so it's forever going. Um, and we're waiting for an outcome on if fishing will be allowed forward. Um, we all know what it's doing to people's lives. There's so many households reliant on the fish they used to catch in a month. And uh, as you know, those guys just walked the road for us. For the last 16 years, we made it our job to, to service the recreational and sports angling industry with information, which for anyone who used to fish back then will know it wasn't something you could get. Um, and all anglers held on to their knowledge and uh, trips and tricks of how to catch fish and uh, we made it our mission for the last 16 years and felt it's our responsibility to assist our industry right now the recreational anglers including the tackle stores wholesalers distributors everyone affected by this to, to do our best from our side and we need your support which we've had for 16 years to be able to achieve that guys we thank everybody that's uh, been part of it already that's filled in that voting poll. As I mentioned before, the ID number is purely there to, to verify your South African citizen. It will not be used, it will be deleted, and it's a secure site for the few mails I received and people being worried about filling in their ID numbers. But again, I want to say thank you to everyone that's already participated. And uh, we're doing our best to try and get everyone, the whole industry, back to normal operation as soon as what we can. Please subscribe to the channel to get updates. Hit that notification button and it will notify you each time. And uh, for the voting, if you haven't done the voting yet, in the bottom I've added the link so you guys can go and support the cause of getting the angling and recreational fishing industry open again.